He shot and killed a young mother and her two year old daughter at their apartment. Today, a judge made sure he will never walk out of prison a free man. The equivalent of about five lifetimes. That's how long an Omaha man will spend in prison for the crime that stunned Omaha. Good evening, I'm Craig DeGrelli. And I'm Jennifer Griswold. The judge sentenced Don Tavis Lloyd for the deadly shooting in a Northwest Omaha apartment in December 2015. Senior reporter Jake Wazikowski was in court today and joins us now live. Jake? Guys, though Don Tavis Lloyd pleaded no contest to the brutal crimes, prosecutors say he hasn't taken responsibility. The victim's family says he almost took everything they had. My daughter and granddaughter were very loving children. They were brought up in a good home. 22-year-old Desatia Strong and her two-year-old daughter, Kinesia, had just moved out of her mother's home to apartments near 107th and Ida, shortly before getting involved with 24-year-old Dontavis Lloyd. It was there the two were brutally murdered. I worked real hard with her for a long time to get her prepared to be on her own. And after he didn't know them that long, he killed both of them. Today, Lloyd is sentenced to two life terms plus 225 to 250 years in prison for killing the mother and daughter and shooting three other women. Dontavious Lloyd, a monster, stole almost everything except my love of Christ. He stole my health, my peace, my comfort, my strength, and most of all, my children. Prosecutors say Lloyd stormed in after being forced to leave earlier that night. He shot Destacia and Kanasia and then went after the other three who were trying to flee. Though he pled no contest, they don't believe he's taken responsibility for his actions. He stood over one of the victims when she begged for her life in the closet. Again, he thought about it for a second and pulled the trigger anyways. He cared about saving himself, I think. Um, I don't think he cares. No. Earlier that same day, police were called multiple times to the apartments because of Lloyd's actions. Stacy says DeStacia begged officers to take him to jail. They took him away, but he wasn't arrested and came back later firing a gun. In my opinion, Dontavius has the biggest responsibility and so does the police officers. The other three women survived the shooting. Lloyd had served three prison terms previously before the murders. Reporting live, Jake Wazikowski, KMTV Action 3 News.